Of course, Gail Benson, who owns the team, will be at the game tonight. Coach Alvin Gentry says she'll be at every playoff game. And you got to imagine she's pretty excited because we said uh, the, the motto is, you know, do it bigger. And it should be do it bigger for Benson, you know? Oh, yeah, I love that. Cool. Yeah. I do. I think we should coin that. Yeah, she's been very visible since taking over for the team mm -hmm. after her husband passed mm -hmm. away last month. And she's one of four women to own an NBA team. Let's take a look at the others. 69-year-old Ann Walton Cranky owns the Denver Nuggets. She's an heiress to the Walmart fortune. And her husband is the majority owner of other sports teams, including the Los Angeles Rams of the NFL. The Nuggets did not make the playoffs. Jeannie Buss took over the Los Angeles Lakers after her father, Jerry Buss, died five years ago. The 56-year-old started in the family business at age 19 as GM of the Los Angeles Strings, which was a professional tennis team. The Lakers are also watching from home now. And rounding out our list is 74-year-old Gail Miller, who owns the Utah Jazz franchise. The billionaire businesswoman took over after her husband passed away in 2009. Miller is the only other female owner to have a team in the playoffs. The Jazz are playing OKC in the first round and that series is currently tied up with one win apiece. Yeah, we've been talking about, about the popularity of, of football and, uh, and basketball. Basketball really rising in popularity.